Hi, I'm Cookie Masterson, and welcome to Fibbage, the only game whose name kind of sounds like cribbage, garbage, and cabbage. Okay, three it is. My lucky number. Or is it my unlucky number? Well, let's play and see if I die. Oh, and if anybody else wants to join, they can get in the audience at any time. Audience people can play along for their own personal scores and can like their favorite lie each question. Let's do this. This is round one, and that means you get 500 points for everyone you fool with your made-up answer. And you'll get a thousand for finding the truth. And you've got a defibrillator. Use it to remove all but one lie and the truth. And just one defibbing per game. All right, pick a category. Okay, here's your first question. The 1993 film Cool Runnings sported the tagline, One Dream, Four Jamaicans, blank. Now, use your device to enter a bluff that you think will fool the other players into thinking it's true. If you can't think of anything in time, use the Lie For Me button for half the points. Do it now! Okay, now find the truth and select it on your device. Okay, let's take a look. And nobody picked the other lies up there. Time to pick a category. It's another New Year's road trip. Let's take a road trip. Next, New Year's Eve, take a trip to the town of Brasstown, North Carolina, and ring in the new year with their annual blank drop. Type in your lies now. Okay, which one's the truth? Let's see what everybody selected. And the rest of the board goes unselected. Select the category. Okay, here's the question. The French have a law that states 40% of all music played on national radio must be blank. Input your lies now. Okay, find the truth. Okay, what did everyone pick? You all nailed it. Also, the tenth color must be awarded with a lifetime supply of despair. And we're done.
This is round two, which means all point values are doubled. And remember to use your defibrillator if you need a little jolt of help. Use it in round two or lose it. Time to pick a category. Okay, here's the question. Archaeologists in Regensburg, Germany, recently discovered something they say is the oldest of its kind. A 250-year-old blank. Enter your lies now. Okay, take a look and find the truth. <laughs> Alright, let's see what everybody picked. After studying the pretzel, they returned it to its rightful home on the counter of a 7-Eleven. And that's it. Alright, pick a category. Okay, I've got it. Okay, here's the question. A 2014 study at the University of Virginia found that people would rather blank than spend 15 minutes alone with their own thoughts. Write your lies now. Where's the truth? <laughs> All right, who picked what? <laughs> and the rest of these lies didn't fool a soul. Time to pick a category. Okay, here's the question. In August 2011, a Nashville highway was shut down after a Greyhound bus spilled four containers of blank. Input your lies now. Okay, where's the truth? Okay, what did everyone pick? Well, I'll be darned. After the spill, the bus rested for an hour and was then back on the road and ready to go. And nobody fell for this one. This is the final fibbage. One question left for all the marbles, and everything is worth triple. Good luck. Here's your final fibbage question. The final unusual ingredient in Kasu Marzu cheese. Enter your lies now.
Okay, here are your choices. All right, let's see what everybody picked. You all got it. Impressive. And I highly suggest getting the free-range maggots. You can really tell the difference. And that's it. Nobody else's lives got picked.
use them until you explode. Ah, endless work. I'm in heaven. <laughs> Welcome to Earwax. I'm Mother, and I will be your host. Okay, here's the deal. Each of you will receive six sound effects on your device. One of you will be the judge. The judge selects a prompt. The rest will choose two sound effects that you feel best represents the prompt. The judge picks the winner. If you're the first player to earn three points, you win the game. Any new players can join the audience at any time, mind you, by just entering in the room code on screen. Be a joiner, shall we? Meet the judge. Please select a prompt. Here's the prompt. Worst sound to hear coming through the walls of your hotel room. Time to pick two sounds. Worst sound to hear coming through the walls of your hotel room. 2020. Five, four, three, two, one. Judge, it's in your hands now. The best sounds have been chosen. They are. 
You are rewarded one point. Congratulations! <laughs> Judging this round will be... Select your prompt. The prompt. Batman taking off his tights. Players, select your sounds. Batman taking off his tights. Onward! A decision has been made. The chosen sounds are... One point goes to you. Way to go. And the judge is... What'll it be? Our prompt will be... The whale sound for horny. Choose those sounds wisely. The whale sound for horny. <laughs> Judging commences now. A winner has been selected. The sounds chosen are... The point is yours. Enjoy it. The judge will be... Prompt time. Pick a good one. And the prompt is... YouTube comment section. Time to choose your sounds. YouTube comment section. Judge, start judging. The judge has decided and the winning sounds are... You have earned one point for yourself. You should be proud. The judge is... Time to select a prompt. Your prompt is as follows. There's only one way to stop these dinosaurs. Sound selection starts now. There's only one way to stop these dinosaurs. <laughs> Let the games begin! <laughs> Judging is done! The winner is... <laughs> you 
You are now one point richer. The judge. Take your prompt. Prompt time. Dad jokes. Select your sounds, everyone. Dad jokes. <laughs> Let the judging begin. A winner has been selected. The sounds chosen are... The point is yours. Enjoy it. Here come the judge. Choose the next prompt. The prompt is... Mom's Facebook posts. Choose those sounds wisely. Mom's Facebook posts. This may take a while. Judge, do your thing. A decision has been made. The chosen sounds are... Stop the gameplay. Based on points, a player has won this game. These are the most like scatters. Way to go. is Quiplash. I'm Schmitty, and you're an acceptable group of players. Well, I hope everyone took their shoes off, because this game has fairly new carpeting. Time for round one. You'll get two prompts on your device. Just answer them however you want. Your responses, or quips, will be pitted against someone else's, and everyone will vote on their favorite. You'll score points based on the percentage of people who prefer your answer. Have at it.
Okay, here we go. The first prompt is... The worst pizza is blank style pizza. Okay, voting time. Pick your favorite. Next one, the worst thing you could stuff a bed mattress with? Vote on your devices. Coming up next, a rejected tagline for Star Trek instead of space, the final frontier was space blank. Time to vote. That's the end of round one. Let's take a look at the scores. <laughs> Round two is straight ahead, and that means all points are doubled. Start this show. Our first prompt is something a weatherman might yell if he completely snapped during the weather forecast. Okay, everyone, vote for your favorite. Next in line. A new, completely BS holiday that greeting card companies would make up to sell more cards. It's voting time. Okay, next one. If you were allowed to name someone else's baby any weird thing you wanted, what would you name it? Time to vote. <laughs> We've reached the end of round two. Let's see what happened. And now, round three, the last lash. Point values are tripled, and you'll all be answering the same prompt this time. Our prompt is... What the lamest transformer would morph into? Okay, soak it in. Vote now. You get three votes this round to spread out any way you like, or give them all to one answer.
It's over. Let's take a look at the final scores. Hi, I'm Cookie, and I'll tell you what, I would catch a grenade for you, as long as it is softly thrown and is actually an apple. Three players. You could have made a human centipede, but you're here with me. I'm flattered. Oh, and if anybody else wants to join, they can get in the audience at any time. Audience people can play along for their own personal scores and can like their favorite lie each question. Let's do this. <laughs> This is round one. You'll get 500 points for everyone you fool. And you'll get a thousand for finding the truth. And you've got a defibrillator. Use it to remove all but one lie and the truth. And just one defibbing per game. Select a category. Okay, here's your first question. Engineer Rodrigo Narciso is giving the world something it's truly been missing. He's invented a device called a CH4 that lets you blank. Now use your device to type a lie that might fool the other players into believing it. If you get stuck, for half the points you can use the lie for me button and get a suggestion. Do it now! Okay, there are your choices. Find the truth and enter it on your device by touching the answer you want. Alright, who picked what? And nobody fell for some of these ingenious lies. All right, make a category. Okay, here's the question. In celebration of International Women's Day, Russian magazine Most published a cover image of Vladimir Putin being blank. Write your lies now. Hit 
Get the lie for me button if you can't think of something. All right, where's the truth? Let's see what everybody selected. But it was a male bear, and it was immediately detained for liking the licking a little too much. And let's put this last one out of its misery. Time to pick a category. Okay, here's the question. Ken Aroni owns a weird business that only makes synthetic blank. Enter your lies now. Okay, here are your choices. Okay, what did everyone pick? This came after his failed rubber genie business. And we're done. This is round two, which means all point values are doubled. And remember to use your defibrillator if you need a little jolt of help. Use it in round two or lose it. All right, pick a category. Okay, here's the question. SS Singh practices the lost art of predicting the future by analyzing blank. Input your lies now. Okay, where's the truth? Alright, let's see what everybody picked. Hmm, I see your future will have a lot of corn. And nobody fell for this one. Select the category. Okay, here's the question. Representing office workers across the globe, Matthias Poem is organizing an international movement and political party focused on banishing blank. Type in your lies now. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. Okay, let's take a look.
time with them. PowerPoint makes me scratch my head while a question mark shoots out of it. And just one lie goes unpicked. All right, pick a category. Okay, here's the question. Iowa State Representative Ross Postian caused quite a stir after he was caught during a House debate reading a self-help book titled Blank. Enter your lies now. Okay, find the truth. <laughs> Let's see what everybody selected. Hey, he was just taking care of his caucus. And that's it. You have arrived at the final fibbage. Everything rides on this one, final question, and it's worth triple. Anybody can win it. And now, your final fibbage question. The mind-boggling thing that two men, one from Colorado and one from California, did every day for over 100 days starting in 2015. Input your lies now. Okay, take a look and find the truth. Okay, what did everyone pick? Here's something you might be interested in. And we're done. Hi, I'm Cookie, and this is Fibbage. Do you like to party? Just curious. Three players.
That's technically a crowd, so please, no riots. Oh, and uh, anyone else can get in and join the audience. Yeah, you can play along for your own personal score, and you can like your favorite lies. Let's do this. <laughs> this is round one. You'll get 500 points for everyone you fool, and you'll get 1,000 for finding the truth. And everyone gets a defibrillator, which removes all but two answers on any question. Save it for a tough one. Select a category. Okay, here's your first question. As part of an experiment funded by NASA, Andrew Iwanicki was paid $18,000 to spend 70 days in blank. Now, use your device to enter a bluff that you think will fool the other players into thinking it's true. If you can't think of anything in time, use the Lie For Me button for half the points. Do it now! Okay, now find the truth and enter it on your device. Alright, let's see what everybody picked. And that's it. Time to pick a category. Okay, here's the question. Ahmedabad, India implemented an unusual reward system that pays residents a rupee for simply blank. Write your lies now. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. Okay, what did everyone pick? And the rest of these lies didn't fool a soul. Picking category. Okay, here's the question. In 2011, a man in Kern County, California, died in a most unusual way after getting stabbed by a blank. Enter your lies now. Okay, take a look and find the truth. Let's see what everybody selected. Well, don't you feel foolish. Man, those things really go out of their way to wake you up. And let's put this last one out of its misery. Now 
That's round two, where all point values are doubled. And remember to use your defibrillator if you need a little jolt of health. Use it in round two or lose it. Time to pick a category. Okay, here's the question. An American soldier in the 82nd Airborne Division was disciplined after he documented himself paratrooping with blank. Type in your lies now. Alright, where's the truth? Okay, let's take a look. Well, you guys blew it. And we're done. Select the category. Okay, here's the question. Starting in 2016, a 67-year-old ban on blank in nightclubs after midnight in Japan will be lifted. Input your lies now. Okay, there's a truth out there. Find it. All right, who picked what? And that means... Make a category. It's time to get to the bottom of things with another diagnosis, huh? Diagnosis, huh? Dr. Mahmoud Bhutta and Dr. Harold Maxwell pioneered a study on a rare condition in which people blank when they are sexually aroused. Type in your lies now. Okay, find the truth. Let's see what everybody selected. Well, I'll be darned. Just imagine how much Kleenex must be on their nightstand. And nobody fell for this one. This is the final fibbage. One question left for all the marbles, and everything is worth triple. Good luck. Take a look at your final fibbage question. Name of the actual 1970s shampoo that was enriched with beer. Enter your lies now.
Okay, here are your choices. Okay, what did everyone pick? Okay, well, you all dropped the ball. My favorite beer shampoos are made in micro-pooeries. And we'll just leave this last lie to die. <laughs>